Hello and welcome to another uh, Mad Hatter's review. Today we are taking a look at the Shredder and Krang NECA 2-pack from the 1987 Ninja Turtles cartoon. Um, Shredder and Krang, uh, these guys are allies of the Turtles, right? Um, is that... <laughs> no, I'm joking, of course. I know who Shredder and Krang uh -oh. is. I had a faux pas on my, uh, on my uh, earlier video where I completely forgot that WTRL is the new station of April O'Neil. It's been a while since I saw the movie. Please forgive. In fact, for retribution, I wore my April O'Neil t-shirt. But we're not talking about April. We're talking about Shredder and Krang. And uh, so, yeah, um, 1987 cartoon Shredder and Krang. Uh, this is not the first time they released this. Uh, the first time was in the... San Diego Comic-Con uh, 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 pack that they did. Uh, you can only get this, I think this was, I want to say SDCC 2016, maybe? Uh, basically, it contains all the turtles. It contains Shredder, Krang, and uh, two foot soldiers. Um, the reason why I'm also bringing this out is because I wanted to do a comparison uh, later on and see if these are exactly the same or what. Um, the reason why I got these is because I don't want to open that pack. I kind of just want to have it just basically, because uh, 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 I didn't open the turtles, so I just want to just, I guess, keep that intact. Um, I know with the turtles, the coloring was different on the new re-releases. They're lighter green. The ones in the original SDCC one were darker green. These were also re-released again in packs with the turtles. So basically, you've got a Donatello. I think it was like Leonardo and Shredder, and then Donatello and Krang. Um, so this is technically the third release. Um, uh, I didn't get the other one, got this one. We're going to open it up. We're going to take a look at that um, and see uh, see how it measures up, not just to the other pack, uh, but to the turtles themselves. Um, yeah, and uh, I'm pretty excited about this. You got Shredder here, you got Crane, you got his bubble walker, and let's go ahead and uh, open it up and see what we got. All right, uh, so uh, we're taking a look at the Shredder first, uh, unboxed. Um, uh, let's take a look at just some of his accessories here. He's got his uh, four uh, hands. So you've got uh, uh, two gripping hands. Then you have sort of these uh, uh, gotcha hands right here. Uh, you have his katana blade, his sword. Um, and then you have his uh, trans communicator right here with the uh, little crank face in there. Shredder, I need you. Um, so onto the figure itself. Solid sculpt of Shredder. Um, looks like uh, the shoulder pads are uh, kind of like a softer plastic, so you can kind of have like some movability gauntlets uh, as well, um, which I do like. Um, you have his uh, his uh, little leg, uh, his, his shin guards as well. And um, what I do like that they did with the spikes is um, they're, uh, they're soft, so uh, not much chance of, uh, of breaking them off. Um, Cape is actually a cloth cape. Looks like it. Uh, the original version was also a cloth cape. Uh, I kind of feel like I would like to see, have seen maybe a, a like a plastic sculpted one, but um, you know, just because uh, you can kind of get some posability in there, or even if there was a wire in there, you can kind of turn this. But uh, yeah, not a huge fan of uh, just standard kind of draping cloth capes for the most part. But uh, but yeah. Um, also, uh, I would have. I, I wish they would have come out with uh, the sort of uh, the, the, the unmasked Aruku Saki uh, head, uh, since this is a new release. I mean, you're going to pay 55 bucks, you know, would have been nice. But I also do understand that if people are getting this for the first time, you're going to piss off a lot of collectors that got the first one if, uh, if, they, if they have to rebuy it just for the head. So I, I understand that as well. But it would be cool if maybe in some kind of future pack, you know, if we can get that head. Um, so in terms of the articulation, um, the... Uh, this one's a little stiff, so uh, might have to uh, use the old blow dryer. But um, uh, you got the, uh, the 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 head swivel, although he doesn't seem to be able to look up very well, just kind of down. Um, you have the ball joints on the shoulders. Uh, you have the, uh, the, uh, the 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 hinge on the elbows. You have the the does it have a hinge on the hand? Yep, yeah, hinge on the hand. Although it's not. Uh, yeah, I don't want to force it. Um, but uh, then you have the uh, the uh, the swivel at the waist. Is there no app crunch? Wish there was an app crunch on this thing, man. Because Shredder, I mean Shredder scraps. He's a fighter, so it would be nice to get a little more a little more posability. Um, then you have the ball joints at the uh, uh, on the legs um, in the in the crotch area. Then uh, you have the the bend on the knee. The bend is actually really good on the knee. Looks like you can get some uh, some cool shit going right there. And then you have a, a boot swivel. 
Yep. And then you have the, uh, you have a rotator on the ankle as well. And do you have the, yep. And you got, you got the toe, the toe joint, um, uh, the toe joints as well. So yeah, uh, pretty good, cool, uh, pretty, pretty poseable. Uh, again, just wish there would have been that app crunch in there, but, um, the turtles don't have that either because they're, it, it would, it, it's, uh, the, the sculpting doesn't really, doesn't really provide that. Um, but, uh, but yeah, uh, cool figure all in all. Um, so let's go ahead now. And uh, my, my dog saw me to wrap up. So uh, we're going to go and ahead and take a look at the Krang. All right. And now let's take a look at the uh, Krang. So uh, let's start with the with the man himself. Um, so you have Krang there. He's got the awesome face sculpt. He's snarling. Uh, the only thing that I think moves on this guy is his little <laughs> his little tentacles. His tentacles are sort of on this ball joint. Um, so you can get a little bit of uh, variation right there. Not too much, but I mean, it's Krang. There's really not much you could do anyway. Um, uh, so yeah, uh, other than that, he's got his little, uh, his little, I think this is a mute, mute gym canister. Um, looks like it. Uh, uh, then you have his little, uh, tripod that he sits on. Um, you saw this in, I think the first, the first season before he got his Android body, he would sit on this little thing and look, it actually does pop in and you can uh I'll pop that in at a later time but yeah you can sit on the little tripod and then of course you have his bubble walker i always liked the bubble walker a lot um there was an episode where i think krang and his other krangs from his planet uh krangazoids i think they call them um they all had their bubble walkers um i remember and uh i hope i'm remembering that right but uh yeah they were all in there and they were sort of walking and doing their thing um let's see how he fits in here because i think you have to almost uh, well, before we do that, let's just take a look at that. So, um, Bell Walker pops open. Then you have uh, articulation here on the legs, which is pretty cool. Although you can't, um, there's no pivot on this side, so there's not too much you can do. These sort of these these, these spin around for a little extra extra variety, but uh, but yeah, um, not a whole lot that you can do on the Bubble Walker. Um, in terms of fitting inside, you know what? I've never popped one of these in there, so hopefully, hopefully he fits. All right, so taking a look at the picture on the box, figured it out, you got to actually pop off his tentacles, which makes perfect sense now that I'm looking at it. And then he's flush. And then from there, you go ahead and you get the old tentacles right on here. I think that's the right one. Actually, that might be that might be the left one. Um, but yeah, I mean, they're pretty they're pretty well made. So um, not don't don't seem too flimsy. So I wouldn't worry too much about uh, breaking them. But yeah. That's sort of, uh, that's the way it, it looks all together, which is actually pretty cool. Um, so, uh, um, yeah, and, and in terms of like uh, moving forward with Krang, you may or may not know, they have the Android body that's coming out, which that's going to be tempting as well. I'm, 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 I'm for sure going to get that. Uh, I still might keep a version of him in the Bubble Walker, though, to display. And, um, and yeah, that is, uh, that's what we're looking at in the, uh, in the Krang figure. So I'm um, going to go ahead also and... Um, I want to take a look and just sort of compare them to what they look like um, here. I took a look before. Um, these, are, these are the original ones from the SDCC line. They look exactly the same. Do you see any difference? Um, I mean, there's... I, 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 was, I, I had opened this before, and other than just some inconsistent paint applications, um, but that's just a NECA thing. I mean, sometimes with NECA, it's a little bit of a crapshoot. Um, they look exactly the same. I mean, Shredder has the cloth cape. Uh, uh, Krang has the uh, same kind of articulation. Um, this gun right here is, I guess, the only extra piece. But I don't. That that seems like more like a foot soldier thing, even though it's it's wrapped up here with Shredder and Krang. So honestly, I don't see any difference. So uh, if you do have this pack, you can open this one up again. I didn't want to open it up because I didn't want to. I just kind of wanted to keep this pack uh, pack uh, mint. But uh, but yeah, that's it. Um, uh, Shredder and Krang. Um, also, if you uh, if you have not seen, you want a sense of scale. I um, mean, I'm going to take some pictures too of these guys together. But um, Shredder's got some good good scale with the Ninja Turtles. He's about a foot taller than them, so that 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 is that does make sense in terms of uh, uh, being to scale with the cartoon. Uh, but yeah, we'll take some pictures. Uh, take a look at what these guys look like uh, 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 together. And uh, yeah, uh, comment, subscribe, let us know what you think, and uh, we will see you next time. Bye bye. Thank you.